let's move on to the second part of question number 1 so in this we are given with sum as 21 over 8 and product as 5 over 16 so my s is 21 over 8 and my product is 5 over 16 so alpha plus beta equals 21 over 8 and alpha dot beta equals 5 over 16. Now we know that polynomial can be written in the form of x square minus alpha plus beta x plus alpha dot beta that is product. So my equation will look like x square minus 21 over 8 x plus alpha dot beta is 5 over 16. Now we need to take LCM of this equation. So LCM of this equation will be 16. So my first term get multiplied with 16. Why? Because we have 1 at denominator. So we need to make it 16. So times time set with 16. So 16 x square minus. Now what we need to do in the second one is to multiply it with 2. So it will be 21 into 2. So it will be minus 42x plus 5. So now my equation will be. My equation will be 16x square minus 42x. plus 5. Now in the second part of question it says you need to find the zeros of the polynomial by factorization method. So here we need to split the middle term to find the zeros of this polynomial we have received. So in this we have 16x square minus 42x plus 5. So we need to take 16 and 5 and times it. So 16 and 5 is 80. Now we need to make factors such that they make minus 42x. So it will be 40 into 2. So we can write it as 16x square minus 40x minus 2x plus 5. Make sure when you are splitting the middle term, you make right decision with signs whether it should be negative positive or positive positive anything it could be like in this case it is minus 42 so i need to write such that it make minus 42 so minus 40 minus 2 makes minus 42 now we need to take common from the first two terms so we can take common as 8x so we are left with 2x and we are left with minus 5 in the last one we are left with minus 1 we will take 1 common. So we are left with 2x minus 5. So here we have two values that is 8x minus 1 equals 0. And another is 2x minus 5 equals 0. So here we are with two values that is 1 over 8. And another is 5 over 2. So these are my two zeros from this polynomial 16x square minus 42x plus 5. So that's your answer for second part. Thank you for watching this.